Hi everyone, my name is Evgeny Shvarov and today I want to talk about uh, unit testing for Iris BI solutions. As you know, Intersystems Iris BI contains of uh, cubes, uh, pivots and dashboards and some other components. Uh, and uh, often uh, the solutions on Iris BI can contain a large amount of pivots and dashboards, uh, like several, even several hundred of them. And when we make changes uh, in this project, when we develop new parts, maybe we change the name of the uh, classes of cubes, of the, change the name of dimensions, or add new dimensions, or any to provide any any changes, we need to make sure that our uh, existing pivots and dashboards they still working and one way we can do that we can go through them manually like clicking all those uh, UI elements and uh, see if they work if the uh, query starting and everything and the data works and there are no bugs um, and uh, the component I was going to talk about today is ICDF, which introduces an option to uh, test it automatically. Yeah, so you can just install it and use it like in a manual testing, like run uh, and go through. I mean, manual just to manually type, go and test all the dashboards or pivots or introduce it in, in your mm, unit testing scenarios. So let's see how it works. How this could be tested. Um, one way is to test everything manually. And this of course exists so you, we can go through uh, dashboards and pivots and test them, run them and see if everything is working. Another approach is uh, what we what I suggest to review today. It's a it's an automatic it's an automatic uh, test that goes through all the dashboards and pivots. And actually, this is what was recently introduced to uh, Open Exchange into the community. This is ICDF module and that can uh, do the thing. So let's set up. Let's quickly set up a basic Iris uh, application. Uh, for example, Iris, let's take Iris Analytics template. RSBI testing. So the plan is uh, to to create a very simple RSBI setup. Yes, uh, this is a basic uh, template for any analytics solution with Iris BI, uh, and it, it also contains already a few uh, dashboards, uh, something related to COVID. Um, okay, there is the COVID cube and some COVID uh, related pivots and dashboards, and one dashboard. Yes, now it works. And so what we need, we need uh, to see if, see if we have some developers here. Yeah, we have something created. Okay, great. So what's about this uh, utility? So let's go and open Iris terminal and let's install it.
Uh, yes, uh, article. If you see the article, um, there is a new article related to this project on Open Exchange on developer community uh, that says yes, there is a method that you can use to check all the pivots. So we tested. There are five pivots, no errors, and there is a package. There is a method that can test all the dashboards. There is one. There were there are two dashboards with three pivots, so all works. Uh, let's install something more serious, for example, samples BI. Samples BI demo. Yes. Okay, great. It is installed. So let's see if we have if we have it working. Yes, we have a lot of dashboards here. For example, let's see. Yeah, something works. And let's check again pivots. Oh, there is one even one error there. So we can. Uh, pass the parameter check on the error, stop on error. Um, yeah, so we'll check this. And also there is a check dashboard uh, function that says on there are no errors. Um, perfect. Um, another question so that maybe you don't want to start this manually and introduce this uh, check into tests and that's uh, perfectly, this certainly is the desired and pre recommended option. So let's see how it works here. And uh, just because of this, uh, to support this decision, this uh, approach, we provide in a basic template an example of uh, class DCR by unit test. It is here. And the unit test is very simple, so you just can, in order to introduce it to your project, you just can copy and paste the similar contents so that uh, we can have two tests, test pivots and test dashboards on assessed OK. Yeah, and uh, just to make, to understand how it works, we can run tests here, so we can go and see, so currently we have Iris analytics sample here. Uh, in a, as a module, and you can see, uh, yes, as a, and also you can see that we have unit tests here, as you can observe. So that means that we can go and run ZPM test uh, name of the package and go tests. So they. There is some failure, even so. Let's ah uh, because this there is a failure because they tested everything that we installed. But so let's see how it, what uh, it has. I'll open this. Uh, we will open it not here, but the similar. Uh, the management portal but a similar link oh, sorry about that yes uh, we can see the test case that is the report's best best this is the error we saw when we test pivots for the installed sample but uh, yeah uh, if you use it uh, for testing your own package this is the way you can follow use this uh, unit as a use this unit test and of course install uh, install 
uh, ICDF uh, module um, on your in, uh, on your Docker image in, initialization part. So this is the, this is it. Uh, so this is that simple, and I encourage you to use to use ICDF and it, its capabilities to to unit test uh, dashboards and pivots you have in your RSBI solution and to save your time for uh, development but not for debugging and uh, for maintenance so that let, let the code do that and also any feedback contributions are very welcome see you in the systems dev, dev community thank you